welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel in this practical video i will show you five big mistakes in the construction of rcc slab with floor beam so let's get start guys as you can see guys this is floor beam design which size is 12 inches by 18 inches depth is 18 inches width is 12 inches inside this floor beam they provided lapping which length is about 12 inches so this is one of the big mistake that's why because this is not the place to provide lapping length this is the place to provide extra steel rods or crank bar to resist negative bending moment instead of extra steel rods they provided lapping length so this is one of the big mistake and the length is also not sufficient for this place next guys they used here 12 millimeter die of steel rod with the spacing of 6 by 6 inches in this RCC slab and lapping is provided inside this floor beam which size is 12 by 18 inches next guys you can see hooks are pro provided on 135 degree in some places here which length is about 3 inches so it's okay but if you see the spacing of stirrups which is maximum here because this is four story commercial building so therefore the spacing should be provided closely according to steel structure design or steel structure load but unfortunately the spacing is same at the distance of l by 4 after l by 4 also y axis and x axis by both directions lapping is provided so if you see the lapping is provided more than 50 percent in this project which is very dangerous for this project so in the future especially at the distance of l by 4 it will provide cracks which can you which uh, which we can reduce uh, especially by the method of crank bar or extra steel rods look here guys this is the other beam look here this is about 12 inches so this is lapping length which is not sufficient you can use the formula which is 50 to 60 d where d is die of steel rod but don't use less than one meter lapping length or you can say four feet you can see guys here they provided three numbers of steel rods at the bottom dia is 16 millimeter three numbers of steel rods at the bottom and three at the top two are side bars but they didn't touch any steel structure design so they did buy a steel fixer so therefore they will face more problems in the future especially for this project if you are working on construction site so see especially these points which i am discussing in this short video to know about lapping length hooks length spacing between two stirrups they used here four numbers of steel rods two are side bars three at the top section three at the bottom section dia is 16 millimeter which is same for all beams look here guys this is at the distance of l by four but the spacing is same which is seven to six inches six to seven inches after l by four this is up to nine inches concrete is weak in tension so therefore at the bottom section they should use maximum numbers of steel reinforcement compared to its compression zone 